If you have a BRAF mutant brain tumor, glioma, those patients can respond very well to the same drugs that we use for melanoma, BRAF MEK inhibitors. There's many, many examples of that uh, over the years. And I think even with EGFR in inhibitors, we've seen responses over the years. So th there is a lot of progress. It's just the heterogeneity is fairly vast in terms of the sporadic glioblastomas that we deal with. But now compared to 10 years ago and certainly 20 years ago, we have like hundreds of targeted therapies out there. We don't have enough time to test all of them, but we do need some big data science, you know, figure out what all these mutations each person has and have an algorithm to say these two drugs are going to be the best or two, two, three, four drugs are going to really work the best for this particular patient and then identify and do trials uh, or, or real world type of experiments because these are all available in the market and, and certainly because our standard treatments don't do a good job. We, you know, many of us do, when we don't have trials, do a lot of off-label treatment based on those mutations and we do see responders.